Where's Ballinolane? Ballinolane is, uh, I suppose you go in, that, that's the handiest way. If, if you go in, say, to Church of Ireland, do you know where the Church of Ireland is? Mm -hmm. uh, in Kimrukas there. Yeah. Yeah. Go down there, the Ballinol Road there. Ballinol Lane, then you, there's the first lane down, a few hundred yards down the road, and it goes right around and brings it back out onto the main the Kilmukwij Wells Road again. Mm. And, and it's called, it goes out to Abandon Lane, it's a little narrow. And a few years ago, they did a whole lot of work on it. Come to took up bits of corners and bits of things. And some smart alley guy himself decided he wrote a song about this. About to run up at Abandon Lane. And we call it the bypass. Okay. And, 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 and that's how I come to write that whole, whole ditty of it. And there's a whole lot of lads mentioning it from around there and things like that. And when we come to that, we'll say Richard Devrift instead of Maria. Okay. Keep an eye on. Keep an eye out for. For Richard. Keep an eye out for Richard Debrix. Okay. I, I think I have Marie there. Aren't you? you have. Yeah. Now Marie lived there that time. We know the girls are married to Crane. All oh, right. So they lived in there that time. You see. Okay. Uh, that's how we the put that there. The and, and with Banlo yeah. Lane is out through Ban the, the townland of Banlo there from Banadam out to, to Newtown on the other main road. You know the main road being up the mm. up up to Wells there. Mm -hmm. yeah. All right. Yeah. <coughs> You weren't recording all that nonsense, were you? I was. Oh, you never know what nugget you're going to come out with, John. <laughs> so, I like that word, nugget. That's yeah. a good, that's a good <laughs> point, you mean. Right. Give it a shot. <clears throat> now, Kilmockridge Village, great crowds you'll see there. And the traffic on the road, there's nowhere to compare. A great meeting was held on a Sunday after Mass. And so was decided on the village bypass Turalay. Turalay. And so was decided on the village bypass. On Ballon Law Lane, everyone did agree. But first to inform the council, you see, John Brown, the TD, a man of great class. Would he dig the first sod for the village bypass? Turalay. Turalay. Would he dig the first sod for the village bypass? Now the question of finance was next to arise. Johnny Murphy, he told them to open their eyes. Charlie Hawhey and Ben Dunn, the men with the brass. They might give a million to the village by pastoral. They might give a million to the village by pass. Kevin Pender spoke up and he wondered in fear. Which end would they start? Would they knock down his pier? Bulldozers and diggers cause pollution and gas. When this work will commence on the village by pastoral. When this work will commence on the village by pass. Tommy Derricks assured them no machinery they'd need. Some shovels and spade, and they'd work at great speed. After taking the bride to the church with the ass, they then draw the clay from the village by pass. Turalo, Turalo. They then draw the clay from the village by pass. Jimmy Furlong was sought for to lead his great team with an army of men from the SCS scheme. He sharpened his side, cut the briars and grass, and so was the start of the village by Pastoralo, Turalo. And so was the start of the village by Pass. You could see deep concern on Ned Kavner's face, a well-known poet who lived in this place, with the ash tree cut down for to make way for the pass. Now where would the banshee rest her old ass? To Turalay! Oh, where would the banshee rest her old ass? Now the work is completed and ready to go. Father Hartley was asked for the blessed, you know, with one rave of his hand as he raised up his glass. Keep an eye for Richard Devricks on the village by pastoral. Keep an eye for Richard Devricks on the village by pastoral.